What's up guys, today I'll be showing you how to fix the Unity failed to load window layout issue on the new version of Unity. This video is uploaded on December 6, 2020. And uh, I'm not sure what causes this. This is a brand new project I'm showing it on. So you can see no matter what button you press, it doesn't really do anything. So I just ended up quitting out of this. You want to go to the bottom right of your taskbar and you want to actually exit the Unity hub as well. Just make sure you have nothing of Unity open. I don't know if this is critical, but I just know I did it this way and it worked without issue. So next you want to go to your Windows hotbar, use percent app data and find the Unity folder, not the Unity hub. Go to your editor and then whatever it says after, preferences. You want to visit layouts, default, and then find the default folder and open it with whatever notepad of your choice. I prefer notepad plus plus. You want to copy all of the text in this folder, the default.wlt folder. So hit control C and copy that and you're safe to just exit out of that. And next you want to go where your project is saved. You want to find that project, go to the library folder and find the current layout dash default. And you want to open that with the same notepad or whatever notepad of your choice. You want to delete everything in there and paste the other default layout and then save it. Now what this should do is it should correct that failed window layout. Now you'll see here I'm going to open Unity and there shouldn't be a problem loading it up at all. Thank you for watching and I hope this quick little tutorial was able to fix your problems. Have a good one and enjoy your developing.